Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Just want to give you a quick update. Um, I'm kind of a week late on this update, but either way. Um, my husband last Friday, today's Thursday, the 1st of February. And last Friday, my husband went and did his semen analysis. Um, his appointment was pretty early, about 9.30 in the morning. Um, he showed up probably about 10 minutes early. He said he checked in, uh, filled out the paperwork, and the reception said that there were there was actually one guy in the room and one or two other guys um, before him in the waiting room. So it took a little bit of time for him to finally go in, but when he finally did, he said that the room smelled like sa like not hand sanitizer, I guess like hand sanitizer or sanitizer that they had I guess he had cleaned it which is good thank god but and that when he walked in he what he saw was a, le a leather lazy boy which I think is kind of funny I mean I guess easy clean up if there's a mess anywhere and that there was a TV stand and several DVDs nicely stacked up on top of those and they were like in their cases um, he actually showed me a few of the DVDs which was hilarious some of the names I was like oh, wow I don't even know what that is um, then he said on top of those DVDs was actual I guess um, there were other DVDs that they had I guess copy there was just like stacks of dvds not in cases so it was when he walked in was the, the leather lazy boy then a tv stand with several uh dvds stacked up then he said the tv there was a tv um mounted on the corner of the room and on the tv stand was a sign they gave you um where to connect to the wi-fi you know i guess most people would just choose not to do um, the DVDs and so he said it was just it said IVF collection room so pretty straightforward I kind of joked with him I was like oh can you imagine all the other offices in that building you know what they think when they try to connect to the Wi-Fi and that one just like pops up I thought that was actually pretty funny and pretty much that was it and oh and he said there was also a there was a door there was a bathroom in that room so there was a door that led to a bathroom and in the bathroom was like like a metal um i'm sure you guys have seen it where it's like a metal thing where you put in um your urine sample in, in a lot of doctor offices um in this case is a semen um sample and on the other side was like the women or whoever worked there um so yeah he's, he's there he said there was a bathroom so he said he pretty much did his business did what he had to do and went into the bathroom and left the paperwork um inside the little box put the semen sample on top and then he said there was like a little switch to which i guess turned on a light to the other side that tells him like you know, there's a sample in here wash his hand did what he had to do and then pretty much um walked out and the lady at the front was like oh that's it you're done your your semen analysis is going to be sent to my doctor and that was pretty much it so not much to update but i guess see you guys next time bye